Hello everybody, we are going to take a look at this 332 ML Outback. Really awesome and modern floor plan and I think a lot of you are going to love this. It comes in weighing 8,400 pounds as the dry weight, so it's kind of in the middle as far as weight goes. So starting with the front, you have your auto leveling system, which is really nice. Two propane tanks under this plastic casing. You also have your fiberglass front cap that does have some accent lights, which look really, really cool. A power awning that goes all the way to your slide out, so you have that extra shade if you need it. And you even have this utility drawer. So I'm gonna wait for this fork truck to pass by. Okay, so with this utility drawer, if you have heavier items um, you can pull this out and be able to place them in there and it just makes it a lot easier stowing them away and taking it out So you don't have to have one of your kids crawl in there and you know retrieve something for you It's just nice to have one of those and then moving along you also have your satellite and cable hookup plus 110 outlet so if you want to have a table set out here, you know have a TV out here or Plug in a blender air fryer coffee maker things like that. You can do that outside speakers as well and these are bluetooth capable so you can plug or hook up your phone to it and be able to listen to music while you're outside relaxing solid steps at your main entrance nice and sturdy plus you have this helper handle um, just for extra support and then you have an outside kitchen so even though your awning ends at this slide out the fact that this door is really really tall kind of is can be used for another awning while you are cooking so that is nice um, there's also a light too so if it happens to be darker outside and you're just starting to cook dinner um, you have that light so you can still be able to have a fun grilling not at grilling at night out here metal countertop so you don't have to worry about scratch marks there's also an outlet to plug in a microwave or just small appliances a couple cabinets too a humongous mini fridge for all of your beverages three sets of drawers and then you also have a couple burners here so you can cook some things at the same time and then all the way at the back since you have your ladder that means you have a fully walkable roof so you can climb up there and just keep up on your maintenance with your camper so let's take a look at the inside So directly to my left is your gorgeous living room and kitchen space. And I want to point out how wide and open this is, which is great for entertaining. And you have absolutely zero, zero carpet throughout this entire camper. The only carpet you have is just this little wiping mat, which you can kind of throw away once you're done. Other than that, zero carpet. So it's very pet friendly. Kind of turning back around by our entrance, you have your sleeper sofa. So this will fold out into a sleeping space for your kids or extra guests. This gorgeous kind of accent wall. I love the design on here. Diagonal from that is your theater reclining seats. These do have built-in cup holders and remote control storage, or as I like to call it, you know, snack storage. And then right across, you have a perfect view of your entertainment center huge electric fireplace down below and what's really nice about that is not only does it heat up your camper but you don't have to use your propane you can use your campsite's electricity and not have to worry about it storage that runs all the way kind of like a u shape and then just above your fireplace is your bluetooth speaker system so that's where you can access your outside and inside speakers and then you got that humongous swivel tv right next to your theater seats is your uh, freestanding dinette, very comfortable seating cushions for your seats as well. And then I also love the darker wood tones um, and the darker colors in the sofas and stuff all across. It just looks really nice with the lighter tones throughout the camper. Windows are all across this uh, slide out too, so you have that natural light coming in. And to our kitchen space, you have pantry storage and also you have some down at the bottom. Right next to that is your refrigerator. It's a really good size. You also have your stainless steel microwave with a built-in wine rack above there, which is really cool. 
And just below, you have your vent fan plus kind of an accent light for your stovetop. And this does have three burners, so you can cook some things at the same time. Plus, you have this protective glass cover. And then there's your oven. Extra storage down below. And you also have a U-shaped countertop as well. Gorgeous white countertops and really, really pretty uh, subway style mimicked backsplash. There is an outlet in the corner as well for, again, small appliances if you want to plug something in. Couple windows too. Stainless steel open sink with a fancy schmancy faucet. Cabinets up above for some extra storage. And even more storage down below. And then over here, it doesn't hang off. Um, but if you wanted to have a couple bar stools, you probably could get some or kind of dedicate this to the kids or not even the kids, just like some office space or a nice little spot for the kids to eat breakfast. Um, but you do have all of this open countertop space for food prep. And the price also comes out to be $45,995 for everything. So moving along to the other parts of the camper, you have your control panel right across from your main entrance. That's where you can access slide outs, awnings, all of that fun stuff. And you have a pass through bathroom into your master bedroom. Directly to my right is your porcelain foot flush toilet. And then to my left, you have from ceiling to floor storage for your bathroom. Lots of space for your washcloths and towels and things. Across from your toilet is your um, rounded out angled shower. Lots of room to turn around in. Skylight as well. You even have this gorgeous black matte finish for your faucet. Same faucet right next to your sink. Um, storage below, plus your outlet and your medicine cabinet. And I also wanna point out that the doors in this camper are gorgeous. They have the same tones um, that are contrasting but are throughout, which are just really, really pretty. It's very modern. And we're gonna go through the main bedroom entrance today. So you have your king size mattress in your slide out, which really opens up this walking space right here. Um, but you do have storage underneath that is actually has a built in kennel door in there. So it's really adorable that they included um, your pets relaxing needs for vacation too. Obviously a retriever or a Great Dane cannot fit in there, but your smaller dogs can definitely feel nice and cozy in there. Or you can just use that for extra storage space if you want. And then above each bed, you have mirror paneled storage, shelving on either side for nightstands, and each one also has a window. And then right across um, at the very front of your camper is your wardrobe. So mirror panel sliding doors again, closed rack extends all the way across, as well as the shelf. And then right next to that, you have even more storage space. Um, you can also use this for a spot for your washer and dryer because you are prepped for it or just put extra things in there. And you also have this humongous dresser, four sets of drawers and maximum amount of countertop space for decorations, pretty much anything you want. Right next to your main uh, bedroom entrance is a spot for an LCD mounting bracket so you can hang a TV up in here if you want. Well, that is it for this Outback, you guys. If you have any questions or concerns, please let us know and we are happy to help.